that is a great question. Why should you step up from optical to HDMI? So it really kind of depends what you're attaching to make that right decision of going from an optical cable to HDMI. Um, and if you look at it, there's pros and cons to both. So I'll kind of lay that out so you can make a good decision for what it is you're trying to achieve in your home theater system. Um, both HDMI and optical pass a digital audio signal from one device to another. So from a soundbar to a TV or a receiver to a TV and or soundbar, obviously that audio is going back and forth. And both cables will do a good job in sending that audio. Um, there really is no difference when it comes to passing that kind of multi-channel audio like Adobe Digital that's been around for a long time. Really the major difference and why you would step up from optical to an HDMI is because HDMI cables can pass a higher resolution audio, which includes formats found on Blu-ray like Adobe True HD or DTS HD Master Audio. And if you're looking at 8K HDMI, now you're even looking at Dolby Atmos and a much bigger surround sound like a 7.1 or a 9.1, where if the true fiber optic cable is in place, you'll basically get that simple Dolby digital audio um, resolution. So that really is the difference between the two when it comes to audio. Obviously, if you have a video display involved, fiber optic cannot pass the video signal too, um, but HDMI can. So if you're kind of looking for uh, not really having too much of a hassle and having one cable do all the hard work in the system for both video and audio, then HDMI absolutely should be your pick.